It's already hung. Yeah, it's too hung to touch. Mike Garner of Raft River is always looking for ways to cut costs on his growing cow-calf operation. He thought he'd tried everything under the sun, and we'll get back to that. Using natural resources has always intrigued me, but just never known how to get my hands on it. And there's always been a cost factor. This is the first thing that's actually penciled out that'll work, and that's why we just jumped on it, because we were so excited about it. In a cow-calf operation, hot water is essential. Add a few hundred hungry calves, and it's critical and expensive. The reason that the hot water is so critical is not only from a sanitary and washing standpoint, which we do thoroughly to, to prevent the spreading of diseases, but we do two feedings a day, one early morning and one in the afternoon. And so by the time we're mixing and filling the bottles, putting the caps on, getting it out to the calves, we want that going in the calves at nearly 100 degrees. Everything under the sun. Then he thought, the sun. That's it. Why pay for expensive propane to heat the water when there's the sun? They stumbled upon a home show. One of the very first exhibits that we saw was was an exhibit of just of these tubes that you see of this uh, thermal solar. And I was quite intrigued because it was different than the solar panels that produce the electricity. And this is their whole pitch was about heating water for your home. So instantly I thought, we, we, uh, we heat a massive amount of water for our calves, and can I save money, because I already knew what we were paying in propane. And he got in touch with Dustin Baker of Idaho Solar Design, and learned that there are rebates, and better yet, the system could pay for itself in just a few years. There's a lot better payback on solar thermal than there is for solar electric right now. Um, it's... Uh, it's a good product, it's easier to get into for most people. Um, you're seeing return on investment for most people around two, three years without incentives, two years with incentives. Products are warranted for 10 years, most last about 20. The way it works, it's simple. Heat up the pressurized glycol on the roof, run it through copper coil into a heating tank which replaces propane and heats up the water, and best yet, it doesn't matter if it's cold, cloudy, or windy. Garner is happy and green and rolling in the green because he found the solution to his overhead problem under the sun. This is Jake Putnam reporting.